Morning walking Ed, Christine Ravesi Weinstein here from the Runner's High. Um, just finished my Sunday fun day run. Um, I went seven miles. The first five were great, felt really good, but I got off to a late start. And so by the time I was on the last two miles, headed back to the house, the sun was shining right in my face and it was all uphill. So I kind of crapped out on the last two miles, but it is not about that. It's about the fact that I finished. It's about the fact that I felt really good for a majority of the run. And it's about the fact that I was able to make an on the fly adjustment. Um, so instead of getting anxious about how I was really starting to feel pooey, um, I didn't let that get to me. And I was able to refocus and reestablish what the goal was. Um, and so for students with anxiety, it's so, so important that we teach them that that sometimes they can be headed in one direction and then they hit uh, a roadblock and we can't just let that stop us um, we have to continue forward so the way that we do that with our students is we celebrate effort not smarts so don't say to your kids like you're so smart you're so smart you know you're so smart when it comes to math tell them like you're working so hard because when they hit that roadblock they're gonna be able to get past it um, and that's what happened to me today. Um, if I had said, you're such a great runner, you're such a great runner, when I started to hit the wall, I would have just walked the rest of the way home. But I was like, you know what? You work hard and you can get past this. So that's the message for this morning. Christine Ravesi Weinstein here for the Runner's High. Check out my new book, Anxious, from Times 10. And I'm always here to remind you, you gotta get out there and take that risk. Cause what if it goes right? Not what if it goes wrong? Take care, everybody.